I'm Glenn Geis. I live in Gonzales, Louisiana. My name is Mitchell James Geis. I live in Gonzales. They say we look like twins. <laughs> Some of the people, but we're not. <laughs> Featuring one of the most bizarre contexts on reality television, Swamp People follows the daily lives of the French-Canadian refugees who settled in the swampy region of Louisiana. The camera frantically follows the activities of the locals in the Atchafalaya Basin as they journey across the swamps in search of alligators. With 12 seasons in the bag the series is currently airing its 13th iteration. The show narrated by Pat Duke has enjoyed success and has also produced a couple of spin-offs. And while its runtime has introduced the world to the unknown side of the Atchafalaya Basin it has suffered its fair share of mishaps. In its runtime of 12 seasons the show has lost two of its cast members Randy Edwards and Mitchell Gust. Randy Edwards Randy Edwards was the youngest son of Junior Edwards. The reality star rose to fame following his appearance in the series Swamp People. A fan favorite Randy has been around the scene ever since its first episode aired on the 22nd of August 2010. Randy enjoyed a stellar career on the show and has made successful appearances in nine seasons. The father of three was not only a great husband but also a great son. He often credited his father for teaching him how to hunt and fish. An expert in commercial fishing Randy worked alongside his brother Willie in the market of Biosoral. What happened? On the 15th of September 2018 fans of the series Swamp People were treated to the worst possible news. The 35 years old Randy Edwards has lost his life in an accident. The news broke out after the Louisiana police were alerted in a 911 call regarding an accident near Iberville Parish. Upon reaching the scene the police found the wreckage of a car and pronounced Randy dead on the spot. The police concluded that Randy got into the accident after misjudging a left-hand turn and drove straight to a pole. Randy accompanied by few other passengers was driving on the Yellow 75 highway. Passengers were thrown out of the broken car due to the impact and Randy suffered severe injuries. The reality star ultimately succumbed to death. The police later released a toxicology report which suggested that Randy might have been impaired during the time of the crash. Another untimely death. In the history of Swamp People the death of Mitchell Giss stands out like a sore thumb. The reality star was also a victim of an accident and took his last breath on the 14th of May 2012. Well, for the production, first and fo foremost, we've lost a really important part of our family and a, and, a, and a treasured friend. My name is Brian Catalina. I'm the executive producer of Swamp People. We got word that um, one of our cast members, Mitchell Geist, had passed away. Mitchell fell victim to the Bell River as he slipped while loading items onto the boat. While initial reports claimed that Gist had suffered from a seizure, it was later revealed that the reality star had been a victim of a heart attack. Gist who was pronounced dead on the Morgan City Hospital was claimed dead for natural causes. He died at the age of 47 and his memory was honored by a special episode entitled Voodoo Bye. Thank you for watching. Give a thumbs up to this video and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Also, hit the notification bell to never miss an update.